So Martin had, Martin, <laughs> we're just best friends. Uh, Martin Luther had made a deal with all of these women who escaped the convent, all of these nuns. There was an understanding that he would have husbands for all of them and otherwise they wouldn't have left. This was still a time period where a woman's success and security was by being married to somebody. Um, and so he had said, I've, I've got that all taken care of. He was a great matchmaker as well as a, a reformer. And um, he had a man in for Katerina, a, a young man that he had chosen who was about her same age, and that he thought they would be perfectly suited for each other. One of the things that's hinted at in my research that I embellished was that um, this young man, his parents, had been great supporters of Luther, had been great financial supporters of Luther, and they wanted to be a part of this big movement. So they were very generous with helping him, but then once they met her, uh, they did not really think she was really great for their son, and um, that kind of fell apart. That arrangement just just didn't happen. He was he went back to school and she still in in the letter that Luther wrote, it doesn't seem like they ever broke anything off officially, if anything was ever put on officially. So it was up to Luther to finally say, Do you want her? Do you not? Uh, then he tried to fix her up with another kind of an old man that she, who she found completely unsuitable. And I think it's fair to say that it was Katerina who said, I will marry you or I will marry nobody. She came to the point where she wasn't just going to be brokered off to whoever would have her. She was very well educated. She was very well read. She was a smart woman. And when it was time to just have her be somebody's wife for the sake of being somebody's wife, that's not what she was going to do. She's not going to just be the wife. She wanted somebody who was her intellectual equal, somebody she could talk to. And in my imagining of the relationship between Martin Luther and Katerina, that is what was the, the attraction between them is that she was witty and, and uh, she could make him laugh and they could have highly intelligent conversations together. That's what was the basis of their relationship.